Hey guys, here's your gaming news for today, Thursday, May 22nd. You can find the source link to the description below to learn more about each topic. 2K Games have announced a release date for their upcoming multiplayer shooter, Evolve. The game hits store shelves on October 21st. Evolve was playable at PAX East and will be playable again at the 2K booth at E3. WW2K15 has also gotten its release date, due out one week later on October 28th, squashing recent rumors that the game may release around the time of WrestleMania 31, which typically occurs in the last week of March. The Retron 5 begins shipping today for $139.99. The console from Hyperkin allows you to play retro video games from 10 different consoles, Famicom, NES, Super NES, Super Famicom, Genesis, Mega Drive, Game Boy, Game Boy Color, Game Boy Advance, and the Sega Master System. It comes packaged with a controller you can use for all the retro games in your collection, but it also has ports for retro controllers from those consoles as well. ZeniMax has filed a lawsuit against Oculus VR claiming they illegally used ZeniMax trade secrets regarding virtual reality and infringed upon copyrights and trademarks. According to the documents, John Carmack assisted Palmer Lucky in development while still working at id Software, a subsidiary of ZeniMax. Robert Altman, CEO of ZeniMax Media, is quoted as saying, Intellectual property forms the foundation of our business. We cannot ignore the unlawful exploitation of intellectual property that we develop and own, nor will we allow misappropriation and infringement to go unaddressed. Check out the link in the description below where IGN details this news and the timeline thoroughly. And that's our news for today. Join us again tomorrow for games industry coverage as it unfolds. Good night, everyone.